Hey, what's up, guys? Elliot Hulse here, just getting the ball rolling again after two weeks of a lot of activity, a lot of stuff, a lot of things, taking my time and energy, uh, all of which were extremely pleasurable. So the last time I spoke to you guys, I was in Amsterdam, uh, and I was able to upload a video that Sunday, but the following weekend, I was offering a and facilitating a grounding camp in Amsterdam that was attended by over a 100 brilliant souls, courageous souls, men and women willing to get uncomfortable and have a good time. And we, we absolutely did that. And then the next day, Sunday, when I would typically upload a video, we were on the road. So I was flying Sunday and didn't get a chance to speak with you guys. But as soon as I returned, it was nose to the grinder right away. We had the Strength Camp World Summit, where on the first day we had uh, over a 100 awesome people at the gym at Shrent Camp and we went through a clinic followed by a business seminar uh, followed by the Grow Stronger experience on the third day and then the Strength Camp challenge on the fourth day so you could imagine I've been pretty busy and a little a little worn out also uh, because I have sustained blessed to receive another injury right so uh, many of you know about my ankle injury I'm going to talk more about it later it's uh it's good that i put it into perspective right because one of the first things that happens when you get an injury is people go oh that's so horrible oh i, I wish things i wish things will be the same or will we'll, you'll go back to where you were and um that perspective of sorrow or feeling bad for me in particular don't ever feel bad for me um and wanting things to be back the way they were prior to a, uh, a tragedy, this is the way people look at circumstances in their life, is not resourceful in any way, shape, or form, but it's the reaction. This is the way people typically think of uh, the events in their lives. Me, on the other hand, I take a completely different approach and I look at all circumstances as opportunities. And uh, so I want to be able to provide you guys with that type of context for my ankle injury and uh, I'll do that in a video coming up here pretty soon but uh, I uploaded a video just a couple weeks ago called every womb wound is a womb right every injury is an opportunity to grow stronger and I don't just say that to console myself or because it sounds cool I say it because it's a living philosophy for me and uh, you know the more challenges I have the you know the more opportunities I have to grow stronger it's a way of life right a lot of people like to watch Elliot Hulse videos to get inspired, but uh, you know when it comes time to apply it, I think it's far more resourceful to watch me do it, right? I'm right there with you guys uh, making my way through life, so watch me put my words to action, and that's what this is all about. But anyway, uh, I upload this video here for you guys today in order to introduce you to some of the work that I had done while I was in Amsterdam. Uh, I was fortunate enough to be interviewed by several really awesome people, uh, four of which you're going to get to meet pretty shortly. Uh, after this uh, message that I'm sharing with you, there will be a trailer for a video that's on another YouTube channel that belongs to four gentlemen who interviewed myself and Colleen while we were in uh, Amsterdam. So. Uh, this video is an introduction to that trailer so that you guys can go over there and watch that and also just to let you know that I have more content on the way I did other interviews I recorded some of my presentations and I want to share some of my experiences and perspectives with you as it relates to the powerful two weeks that I just came out of it's almost like uh, one of my teachers put it this way with regard to the rapid evolution that many of us experienced over the past several months uh, as being in the Starship Enterprise, right? You know when things, uh, you go into hyperdrive and it goes real slow at first, and then it claps and then it shoots off? Well, that's how my life has felt for the past two weeks. It seems like things were moving and then clapped into hyperdrive. And, uh, and so I'm trying to process it. And then at the same time, draw perspective and uh, use it as a way to share and speak with you guys. So I uh, look forward to that and uh, look forward to watching this interview. I'll see you guys next time. Done.
We'll start just like we finished. <laughs> I'm well.